Hey everybody, we're kind of coming to the home stretch. We're into the modern games now, and we're just going to be looking at like kind of what should be exciting us for the release coming up. Like the actual release window games is what I concentrated on for these last couple segments. Here we go. And sorry, I didn't take out all these. Yeah. That's okay. No. Yeah, I'm gonna go. Oh. oh. Rise. Live action Rise trailer. Whoa. Not that they needed it. The graphics are so real. So this guy is kind of supposed to be like a cross between he's a God. Kratos, Kratos and Jason Statham, <laughs> Russell Crowe. He seeks vengeance. Better say them. I hear he seeks the truth. That's right. How long for them soft, Charlie? Pure Statham. That's a big man. Yeah. He's How can you even beat that thing? Well, I didn't even notice the transition in the ground. Yeah, neither. Yeah, fucking gorgeous. Actually, that's cool. Um, Riz. <laughs> Only one. Riz. <laughs> I don't want to like son of room. Shit on the parade, but uh, <laughs> I saw. <laughs> you don't want to shit on the parade. <laughs> one reviewer said that it's about as much fun as dialing numbers into a telephone. Uh, really? Because it continues apparently to be whoa, 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 how or rotary. But. <laughs> That, that's super fun because you can like try to go faster. What's your name, soldier? <laughs> and do like songs. Yeah, make words. And if you telephone. Because um, the that's thing is. The 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 town. Oh, his family died just like Kratos. Everybody's and, Yeah, everyone's family died. And Russell Crowe. You must save Rome. Oh, oh. we're going to save Rome. From there. From who? We're going to give it back to the Republic. <laughs> And Anthony Hopkins also died in front of him. Those who went to the Deacon, you could do that Pewter. probably now. Yeah, I think you're Easy. Yeah, three different blogs have like blasted it, saying really? it was just... I can hardly let you it didn't feel like you were playing a game. Uh, it's like Beyond Two Souls may be the action game. Like, or, yeah. you know... Was the story good? It's not challenging. Well, I don't think that they got a grasp for the story since they only played portions. But as far as gameplay goes, it's basically got the same complaints that they had since E3, which is that it's it doesn't feel like you can fail. Fight for your yeah. Son. Fight for your legion. Fight for Rome. So the storyline doesn't pick up for it at all, though. I don't Seems think they're like judging the storyline. Oh, okay. I think they're really judging the fact that you have no input as a player. Uh, It'll say to press buttons, but if you don't, it's like, okay, we'll just Everything. kill the guy. We'll just press it anyways. <laughs> oh my god, he died. Here you go. <laughs> oh, he slipped and tripped and killed himself on your blade. <laughs> that you sliced through him. <laughs> they just have heart attacks. Medusas died of fear. I heard it was being cut for nudity in America. Oh, for fuck's fuck you. sake! <laughs> god! Put a fucking rating on it. Damn it! And give me my goddamn tits. Exactly. The Dotto had tits. Everything Man, else God of War 4 that we played on the show had tits like yeah. immediately and oh, yeah. lots of them. Nice. Yeah. It was really gratifying. <laughs> They're not always nice tits How? either. Yeah, Sometimes totally. Sometimes they like, you know, harpy tits. Oh, but these yeah. ones were yes. good. He like yeah, walks into a... Like a yeah. <laughs> and it also... It was a calming effect because it got them out of the way. You didn't yeah. have to think like, when are my tits coming? When are I going to see my tits? You're not like all jacked up and waiting yeah. for my tits. Because you were getting really upset for a while. Yeah. <laughs> so when you look at trailers like this, it really feels like they're trying to make a God of War, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, it's clear from the outset what they wanted to accomplish with this game, and that's to have a controlled environment, one where the player doesn't have too much freedom, and that's okay so long as it's still fun and challenging. Yeah. yeah. Oh. Because they want to keep the action contained so that they can really Pump squeeze every, Pump. every Pump. bit yeah. of juice out of the graphics. Yeah. Because if the player can't run over to the bush over there and act like a fucking idiot, that guy's bush can look as awesome as fucking possible from that exact from that exact angle. distance yeah. and angle. Yeah. yeah. Until you go and fuck around. With the black yeah. And I'm okay with games that do that. Yeah, like, yeah totally. Why not? But there's no reason for it to be with crying, what it sounds like it's being. But again, I will reserve it's, judgment until yeah, I play it myself. Yeah. 
Xbox on. Oh my. Four, um, by the way, two, you guys one, feel like you you guys are all fatties, right? Yeah. You look fatties. like fatties. Fat. I'm pretty fat. Yeah. So fat. Maybe you should find- Oh, oh P90X! If I do it's it, will Tony. I get tits like that? Fake tits? Yeah, sure. I'll buy them for you if you do this. <laughs> yeah, P90X. I want to grow them for real. Oh, can we do hip hop apps? That guy. Oh my god. Can we do Tyro? So he owns P90X? Yeah. Okay. He's amazing. Apparently Why he is. Why is he amazing? Just his like, He kind of like flirts with you and like, and just, apparently he does get you That guy's also like 50 something. Well, the black the guy here seems like the exact opposite. Yeah. yeah. Watch, watch, watch this other dude. He's basically nothing but contempt. How does it know your heart rate? Oh, it's actually, actually. Does it give you a thing to wear? It's really fucking so. cool. It can detect your heart rate. I saw the science behind the it. The fucking. It's, the camera? The connect to detect your heart rate. What? It's like there's gonna be a lot of fit people with is cancer. Is it gonna give me cancer? <laughs> no. Um uh, what is it? Because it's got infrared, it, can... it knows the heat of your body and it can detect the, when your blood pumps, it creates little oh, okay. spikes. A pulse. Wow. Yeah, in, that makes in sense. In that heat. And crazy it though, can see that. But that's, and that's future fucking really cool. cool. We've always said the Kinect is goddamn cool. If only they'd do something yeah. worthwhile with it. Anyways, this guy is like the exact opposite of who you're describing. Beach body guy? <laughs> Watch his face. It's always contempt for you. And what are these women supposed to be? Look at he's just like. Transform your yeah, that guy's like 55. Yeah. That's right okay. Now. Are you ready for this? <laughs> Uh, he's like, he's like, he knows you're like, not. I'm gonna fail. <laughs> yeah, he's calling yeah, you out on the fact yeah. that you're going to fail. You should probably return his product, but he made sure that it has no refunds. Starts right now. Are you ready for this? <laughs> I don't think you're ready. I'm not, for this. I'm I'm not, not. motivated by you. I'm just, I want to go to sleep now. <laughs> <laughs> Who is that guy? So uh, are we starting get January it? 2015. Well, the thing is, what? I don't, I'm, I, from what it looks like, there's minimal integration. It feels like just their products yeah, yeah, it's probably repackaged just and sold. Yeah. Unlimited access yeah. requires, yeah. what the fuck are they Station saying videos there? and everything all included. Uh, yeah, next stuff. It didn't really make any sense. My body is not ready. It was to start again. This is... Draco was a new beginning. Draco. Oh, yeah, this, this um, game doesn't get a lot of love from Xbox in terms of promotion. Second chance. I think that they already be so easily settled. I think they already had a Kinect game with dragons like this. I think it might be a yeah, sequel. Yeah, you might be right. But it has like future stuff in it too. The white future dragon. Oh, eternal reminder that we were. See, so yeah, there's that. I don't know. It's got dragons. I'm not interested. Crimson <laughs> dragon. Hmm. It didn't really look compelling. Yeah, I, don't, I need people. I need characters. <laughs> It's the Panzer Dragon Dragoon sequel. At least Kinda. with these warnings on it, Bum. Deacon knows when to look away. Yep. This is scary. I saw a chainsaw, uh, some sort of saw on the stick. Well, this is one of the biggest draws. Yep. Uh, oh, yeah. To the 360. Dead Rising 3. <laughs> The wacky is still here. <laughs> Dude, was that a Three Amigos outfit? Yep. It seemed, well, yeah, yeah. I mean. At least inspired. It could be any mariachi, yeah. I suppose, but. There will probably be some elements of Three Amigos. This is their biggest asset right now in terms of exclusives. Yep. Everybody wants yeah. this game. Yeah. And Capcom has made it very clear it's not coming to PlayStation 4 at all. At all? Ever? Oh. And you and me, nice. doesn't no matter, matter how we toss the dice, it's zombies for all the one for me, and zombies, so happy birthdays! I love zombies, you're the other's hands, but so this is by the monkeys, right? I want to get somebody else. Only on Xbox One. Ooh, and that's, that's, what even watch <laughs> and that's that how you make money. <laughs> okay, this is what I was gonna. This is the. 
I told you I didn't want to spend much time on the controversies mm-hmm. and stuff, but this one just cropped up, and it, it hits close to home. Controversy? Okay, so this isn't the guy who... Okay. A bunch of people got Xbox Ones early. Yeah. What? By accident. Oh, <laughs> shit. Target sent them out early. So... <laughs> oh, Target, <laughs> you suck. So, clearly... Oh, wow. Oh, nice GoPro. One excited guy decided... Not this guy. This is just the one guy whose footage I found of it. Um, these guys before this only had picture uh, videos of their pickup truck, so they obviously <laughs> got it early and said, "We got to YouTube it." Yeah. They were never YouTube, but there was one guy who got it who did have a YouTube gaming channel and started putting up videos of the dashboard and it how things work in, in the dashboard. He didn't even put up any gameplay yet; he just put up like how you sign up. Yeah, they yeah. so they've been banning consoles who connect. Jeez, um, right. See, his Christmas is ruined. Yeah, yeah it yeah. is. Um, but the guy who posted footage of the dashboard, uh, he, he he got a copyright claim on his video. Jesus and Christ. not just a claim, like we get, like where they say, yeah, yeah, like, yeah. you Jesus. know, do you agree that we will... Dude, and he's on crutches, too. Oh. oh. Bad form, oh. Xbox. Because yeah, there's claims, there's content ID claims where they say, hey, you got something in there that's ours, we think, and we're going to put our advertisements on it, not yours. So that happens. Which a lot of the time I don't disagree with, but that's another topic. But in this case, the Microsoft went after the dude and gave him a strike. You get three of those, and your YouTube account is deleted. Which Microsoft is like massive. For... Gave a strike to a guy with a copyright claim on things that they can't. That's yeah. like saying, uh, and I made this analogy on on Twitter. That's like me being worried about awesome video games because I have Ikea shelves in the background and yeah, Ikea exactly. might say, you've got our product back there. Mm-hmm. You're making money with our product. But if it was our product that hadn't been released to the public yet? <laughs> There's no law but that says it's that not yeah, their fault when a that product has not yet been you. released, yeah. when a video That's game... <laughs> uh, take this down, Jefferson. If a video game is invented, when video games are invented, <laughs> make sure that if it is pre-release, that copyright law defends it vigorously. Yeah. No. That's the only yeah, way that Microsoft up, could do yeah. something to this guy is legally, and remember, this doesn't matter because it's the court of YouTube, so this is all moot, but in principle... The only way that they can hurt him legally is if he had signed a non-disclosure agreement. Yeah. And he didn't because yep. he's not press. Somebody fucked up, gave him the stuff early, deal mm-hmm. with it. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you can't, but it's a fa- that's what really makes me angry is false DMCA. Uh, D, D, it's not even our law. We're yeah. Canadians. DMCA, Digital Millennium Copyright Act. I don't even know what the it's, fuck that it's is. A bu- it's a thoroughly abused system. That takes things down because like to solve for a lot of stuff. Many problems that aren't yeah. copyright. Right. It's a bullying technique. Yeah. Anyways, that's my rant. Um. It's only blocked until launch day, though, right? Yeah, the consoles are only blocked till launch date. But until this point, I've heard nothing about those copyright strikes being released. Illegitimate copyright strikes. Uh, anyways. Uh, we'll be back after so this with uh, some more Xbox. That's the last of the controversy. I want to concentrate on you know the console itself, and there are things to be excited about. How did they screw up? 